It's me, Mario! Hmm. Ah! Oh. Yahoo! <laughs> Yahoo! Oh, hello, you are? Okay, your name's Law. I can see that you're a trainer, so that means you use the Pokemon storage system I developed. How I arrived at that conclusion is a simple deductive process. You spoke to me because you wanted to access something on this PC. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm Lynette. Honestly, I'm glad to meet you. It's great that you're using your storage system. If you could, please visit me at home. My house is on Route 114. All I wanted was to use a dang PC, now I have to go to some stranger's house. Jeez. Anyways, hey there guys, Luigi Man's 22 here, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Pokemon, uh, I almost said Leaf Green. This isn't Leaf Green. It's Emerald. Pokemon Emerald, Leaf Green Edition. On the last episode! I, I, I don't know. S stuff happened, we were in Route 111, 112, 113, I think it's 113. I'm just gonna buy some things real quick, more specifically Pokeballs. Because you never know, I may want to catch some Pokemon. Actually, let me get some repels too. Just in case. Ah, let's get 20. Let's blow like all of my money. Let's blow off all the money that I've won fairly in battles. I don't think anyone gives me anything here anyway, so it just doesn't even matter. Anyways, this right here is another battle tent. This is like the last battle tent you can actually find here, so. What is this one? Oh, oh, I know this one. This is a judging one. Yeah, I'll show it off. Hi, Lana! So you came miles to this battle tent. The people on these parts tend to be easygoing and laid back. But you see what I'm looking for are people with, how should I say this? Someone bursting with the desire and the drive to win. If there were a trainer like that, I'd immediately... Uh, yeah, well, never mind. Keep working at it. I'm just gonna walk away. Do you give me anything? No, you don't give me anything. You, you guys, you thought it was a Ted. Alright, let's just show this off real quick. Uh... Alright, so... You can only enter three Pokemon here. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but yes, you can only enter three, so we're gonna do this. Because I honestly don't care, and I'm just gonna, you know, quit immediately after this. Don't know why I wanna save, but whatever. Um, uh, in this battle tent, you are basically judged on stuff. You're basically judged, really. I forgot what the three criteria are, but I know if you don't, if you don't pass, if you don't win the judging after like three turns, then your Pokemon immediately loses. I don't know, it's weird. It's a fun and weird type thing, and I guess this battle will be an example. Just a note, every, your opponent's Pokemon will always be at level 30. So, I might be screwed in that department, but whatever. I should have used Headbutt. I now regret my choice. Because I didn't know that Sandshrew could no Focus Punch. At least you get to see how it works. And look at that damage! That's a great start. Alright, Shocks. Oh yeah, you also don't get to choose. So, ha. Ah, I'm screwed in that department. I will use quick attack, cause I have nothing else to attack that Stantru with. I hope it doesn't know any ground type, although as far as I know, I think it's only using focus punch. Okay, J just one more. One more. KO it! You did it, Shocks! You did it! Alright, that's three turns. That's it! Go to judge and determine a winner! Judging category one, mine. The Pokemon showing the most guts. Oh my god, is this gonna be a tie? Okay, I won. It, okay. So that's how they judge. They judge basically on those three. I don't know what mind is. I know skill is like variety of the moves you have, and body is, you know, obviously how much health it has left. Forgot what mind is. Oh well. It's four and two, so I won. And now Sanshu immediately dies. That's how it works. This is how this battle works. Oh my god, it's a Whalmer. Shock versus Whalmer. It's a Whalmer.
can't use curse. You can't. It's illegal. Alright, whatever. I'll shock it, and then we'll see where it goes from here. Oh no, rain dance. What am I gonna do? Oh no, the rain continues to fall. I will use sparks and end it off right here. This is like the most entertaining battle ever. Mm-hmm. Oh, nuzzly, huh? Wow, this is gonna be interesting, but you know what? It's just oh don't you don't you don't give me swag. I don't need your swag. I could come up with my own swag. Ten out of ten has the best swag. Come on, shocks, you don't need someone else's swag to win. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. Alright, let's try quick attack, cause why not? Oh god! God! Now here's that boosted attack! That did a lot! <laughs> okay. That was awkward. Um. Oh, right. Torment! I hate that move. Always get. I always get Torment and Taunt confused. But whatever. I think Shock has this. No! Don't give me more swag! I can't handle all this swag, yo! The swag is real. The rain stopped and the final judging will commence. Yep. I got that. Man, screw you. Yeah. Bye, Nosley. You will go out. I am Saturn. Alright. Man, that's basically the, this battle tent. That's all it really is. So, I will retire, thank you very much. Yes, I will retire from the set KO tourney. I, I don't want to wait. Don't. Alright. So that's basically it. Like I said, it's not the most exciting... Oh, this is an exciting thing, but it's just like... I don't know. This is one of my favorites. There's an item here. Yep, nugget. Always a nugget here. And in this this place right here is the movie learners. So if you have like a Pokemon that's you know that yeah, learned a move, but then you accidentally delete it, you can come here as long as you have a heart scale. And those are hard to come by. The heart scales, yeah, those are hard to come by. All right, there's nothing else in this town to do, so I'm gonna leave here. Go over here to Route 114 into this house, and you have you're the one who gives me the items. Yep. And we get TM28 over here, which is dig. It's just great. And there's nothing else beyond that. I want to check the TV first off, uh, before I forget. Search the trainers. Hi, I'm visiting an area near Route 111. We're trying to spot some up-and-coming new talent in the field. Today we, today, we turn our lens on the trainer Lana. There's something about this trainer that procured, procured our interest. The best way to determine how strong a trainer is? Well, the fastest way is to battle, and so we begun our, began our investigation. And that's how we ended up in battle with Lana. In a dominating performance, we were flattened, rolled up, and tossed aside. You know what? That's pretty much accurate. Pretty much accurate. Lana is ruthlessly strong. Here's our impressions after having battled our featured trainer. The combination of Zigzagoon and Marsh Jump was divine. Decided them, Zigzagoon and Marsh Jump, selflessly supporting each other in the thick of battle. It was a marvelous sight to behold. Water Gun was the move the trainer used last in our battle. The move Water Gun is Zigzagoon's and Marsh Jump's sign of friendship. Actually, it's pretty much headbutt, really, but okay. After our battle, we asked Lana for a 16 su succinct su word summary. Trainer replied, awful. Lana's Pokemon, Zigzagoon and Marsh Jump. And awful. Hmm, that's deep. There's deep significance behind that quote. There's nothing deep about it. That battle was awful. You guys suck. It's no surprise. A good trainer has a good thing to say. I said an awful thing. Literally. That's all for today. That broadcast was awful. It really was awful. Alright, let's continue going on over here. And then we can get another team actually right here from this guy. I'm not going to use it, but hey, if you want roar, there you go. 
It sends Pokemon skewering and junk and like if you're using a battle before it switches. I want that item, but I don't want to battle, so I will ignore you. I will ignore you for the sake of my sanity and time. Damn it! Damn it, I walked into that. I walked into that. That was my fault. Not really, but... Okay, he sent out a Meryl. That's fine, I guess. I have lines. It was completely healed up and not completely burned. Yeah. No, oh, look at that, two damage. That's cute. That's why he got KO'd. Are right, you gonna send out now Lombre? Alright, a Lombrel. Lombrel. I think that's what I call it, a Lombrel. Alright, Ace, you know what to do. Wing attack it. Wing attack it and destroy that Lombrel. There we go. Bye, Lombrel. And we did it. All right, let's keep going. Um, not ignore you and go in here, cause this is where Lynette lives. Oh, Lana! I'm sorry everything's so cluttered. When I get engrossed in research, things end up this way. This is embarrassing. Please keep this a secret in exchange for dish, and we get in this dish, this, this. We get a little tad doll. This uh, little decoration for a secret base. Um, yeah. You know, secret- oh, damn it! I walked into that one, too. Who taught you about Pokemon? I don't know. No one, really. No one, really. Alright, who are you gonna send out? Roselia and Graveler. Okay. It's a good- it's not a good thing. I thought- I thought Swamps was up in front, but... No, no. Don't hit but Shocks. Alright, Shocks, you get back into your ball and I'm gonna send out Swamps, cause this is kinda dangerous. In fact, this is already dangerous, cause I just realized Roselli is still here. Oh no, never mind. Headbutt killed it. Ah! That's funny. Lines you below. Well, I was ready for someone to grow another level, but okay. That's fine. Uh, just use Rock Smash and then Water Gun. Yay! It did that much damage! Hooray! Oh god, roll out! Oh god, it's getting a little tougher. Oh, yep, there we go. We won. Who has a graveler? What an amazing battle style! Yeah, I know, right? It's totally 10 out of 10 worthy. Yeah, let's just keep going. Uh, I think there's an item over here, hidden, right, right behind that guy. Speaking of Lombrels, there's a Lombrel. Sorry, Lombrel, I'm not getting you. I don't care how much you want to be on my team, I'm not using you. Alright, let's just get this. Carbos, that's, uh, item for EV training. Never using it, maybe, I don't know. Sup, Sir Viper? Still not using you. You're probably good, but no. No, not JPEG. Alright, let's just keep going. Uh, is there anything over here? Some rock smash, but I think it's more for secret base. Secret base worthy stuff. Uh, that too. That guy's just spinning in circles. He's easy to avoid. <sighs> Alright, if I'm getting into a double battle, I better prepare myself. Um, swamps go here. Alright. I gotta time this right. Go! If you're not prepared, you shouldn't be off in the mountains. Have you made your Pokemon evolve very much? Is that even a question? The answer is yes. Two of them are fully evolved. Two of them of which I will destroy you with. Maybe, I don't know. Oh look! You have a Lombrel! I wanna destroy that Lombrel! Alright, let's see what we can do here. We can do headbutt on that. I don't even know if I targeted you, but now I know. And then water gun that Geodude, because uh, screw Geodude, and uh, yeah, ooh, wow, critical hit. I'm pretty sure I would have went and KO'd anyways. And Swamp School level, that's great. Sending out a Meryl. 
Meryl. Okay, let's see. Can do that dude dude's gone. Lions grew level. Nope. Something. At least in the end now. A normal. Ooh, normal. I will destroy it. I will destroy that and that Meryl. I will destroy two things today. And there goes the novel. I stopped talking for a minute and I don't know why. Alright, this is just that Meryl to take care of and that's it. And that Meryl is gone. Hooray, we did it. Mountains are unforgiving, yep. Mountains are jerks. It's a proven fact. Alright, let's see. Let's just keep running here. Hopefully avoid more trainers like that guy. Da 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 da. I'm so pro at dodging trainers. Alright. Let's just uh, go in here then. What is this place? Meteor Falls? Okay. It's great. And then first things first, I think there's an item here? I don't know. I always assume there's items in craters. Mostly because, like I said, I played this so many times I know like everything behind like the back of my hand. Although I do not want that too bad. Mm-mm. No zoo bat. All right, what's up here then? Full heal. That that will be useful later. I will probably use it soon. All right, let's see what's going on here. Besides getting interrupted, it's another zoo bat. Oh my god, we're getting into the zoo bats already. Uh, let's run away. Let's go on through here. And oh hey, there's something going on down there. Hi Zubat, no one likes you. Get out of here. Get out of here. I'm not using you. No. Not this time. <laughs> With this meteorite, that thing in Mount Chimney will... Hey, I don't know who you are, but if you get in the way of Team Magma, don't expect any mercy. Run it right there, Team Magma. You, you're badly mistaken if you think you can have your way with the world. Oh no, that's Archie. Whoops. I thought it was some grunt. Okay. <laughs> Even Team Aqua joins us. But it's too much trouble to deal with you all. <laughs> it doesn't matter. We got this meteorite, so off to Mount Chimney we go. <laughs> Be staying at your Team Aqua Dangpat. <gasps> Can you even say that? I thought this was a children's game. Dangpat. I don't remember what voice I gave you. It's like some kind of pirate. Oh. Didn't I see you in before at Slave Ports Museum? Ah, so your name is Lana. At the time, I thought we were one of Team Magma's goons. Huh, <laughs> you're all not, kid. Team, Mag uh, Team Magma's a dangerous group of total fanatics. They engage in destruction, claiming to expand the landmass. They are the rivals to us, the sea-loving Team Aqua. Boss, we should give chase to Magma. Yes, yes, we must. We gotta hurry. There's no telling what Team Magma will do at Mount Chimney. Lana, you should keep an eye out for Team Magma too. Farewell. Um, okay. Don't, didn't realize you cared. What's going on with you? Uh, I, I'm Cosmo. I'm a professor. Team Magma asked me to guide them to Meteor Falls, but they tricked me. They even took my meteor right away. And then another similar bunch, Team Aqua showed up. Yes, I was just here. After that, I don't understand any of it. But that Team Magma, what are you gonna do with that meteorite at Mount Chimney? Uh, I don't know. Probably something horrible? Something terrible? I don't know. All I know is we're gonna have to backtrack to Mount Chimney. And we'll do that on the next episode of Let's Play Pokemon Emerald. So if you like what you see here, just slap that like button. Really like what you see here, just slap the subscribe button. You won't regret it. If you do, blame yourself for listening to me. And I'll see you guys next time. Wait, what? We're in Team Magma, they're Team Magma. It totally annoys me that they use a name like ours. But, 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 but they're... Do it for a little. What? Um, I need an adult pony. Keep pony. What? D uh, d uh, wow, that does. Da 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 da. Da 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 da.
Da 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 da. I can't see through the grass. This is terrible. Da 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 da. Where is it? 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 Where is it?